Hello, 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 everybody. Good morning, good good day, <laughs> and good night, wherever, whenever you're watching my FM Signal show. My name is still Damian Galic from Good Old Germany, of course, and you're welcome to another 48 hours technical analysis and synthesis. Today or tonight with the New Zealand dollar, Canadian dollar, so analyze this stuff again, it's still yours. New Zealand dollar, Canadian dollar. Okay, now we're online. It's t Tuesday, the 10th January 2012. It's 23.09, <coughs> of course, Central European time, or even 17.10 on Tuesday in Toronto, or Wellington, Wednesday morning, 11.10, or wherever you are. So, Okay, I'm choosing the New Zealand dollar, Canadian dollar, and we are see, we are watching here the one uh, hourly chart. Uh, yes, one hour chart, and we see here something like a sideways trend or a bullish or much more uh, bullish triangle. Yes, triangle here uh, in December, and here the massive uh, upside trend since the last week of last year last week of last year, even the uh, last two weeks, and here something like an, a top. And that's the reason why I'm choosing this chart. So uh, it looks like pretty uh, bullish to me, and even for the short entry for the next 48 hours, I'm hoping to get here a short entry. So, yo, analysis, it's still yours. Okay. Of course, uh, let's go ahead. I'm zooming this chart here. It's of course here the upside trend of the last two weeks and uh, this actual week, the third week, we see here this upside trend, the, uh, here the, you know, the resistant and here the breakthrough and here something created something like a flag and interesting for me is also here this candlestick, this candlestick here, this massive upside trend. Uh, about 0 0.80, much more, 0, 0, 0 0.80, 50, 50, and we are trading here something I like about it, and then we comes down the last hours, or even the last trading session of New York and Europe. So, an interesting uh, development today, and uh, yeah, that seems to me for, or screaming for me for an into a uh, contrarian position even for a short trade. So, but it's only my opinion, of course. Analyze this stuff again, it's still yours, and make your own decision. So, okay, here I'm got, uh, I'm creating also, I'm zooming the one uh, hour chart, of course, adding here with the candlesticks out, not with the bar charts. Here we see all, uh, and again here the trading sessions, even of Canada, of Toronto and Wellington, of course. So, uh, yes, we are trading right here right now in the Wellington time. The highs and the lows of even trading session, you can also, uh, also, how do you say, uh, realize it. Yes, realizing it. And we see here on the yesterday trading session, even yesterday evening, uh, we see here the upside trend, or last night, Central European time, 
the upside and in the New Zealand dollar and here I'm uh, yes and I'm hoping here or I'm I'm preferring here the short side in this area and I'm creating here in this in this uh, in this cycle one cycle again here this the upside trend the green bar and here the three uh, the three red bars red candlesticks so uh, it seems to me for an uh, from button yes for a button how do you say in English so yes the question is of course what will happen I of course don't know even don't know it too but I would prefer the short side I'm creating here uh, the high something above the highs of my broker here uh, by 0 0.8 8101 uh, of course yes so it's a sharp uh, entry to go short here make the stops here if we if so you're you're prepared if you're squeed off if the bulls are uh, if this cr cross rate still going the bullish upside trend and if uh, the price goes down this week I would take this 0 0.80 0 0.80 101 as a short entry too so okay yes uh, in the end I want to something say I forgot it ah yes of course here the last start yes of course I'm also uh, preferring also the bull the bullish side to go long who know who don't know or which uh, forex trader didn't uh, didn't like go long than short of course so I'm creating here uh, a mirror chart here we see oh yes now the data is not uploading one moment please come on one moment please okay we are back it's 23.18 and here is the mirror chart which I'm creating created so and you can see it's the same chart only here is the mirror here you can imagine the mirror line and so the up downs and even uh, what I want to say I also prefer the long side of course and it's something too hard to get short but if we even create a mirror then it's here down the 0 0.81 line here above the 0 0.77 line of course and it looks like a good bull entry even <coughs> even a mirror chart or a bearish entry for the shorties so sometimes open this uh, chart your mind and I hope as a useful add also for you and uh, yes even here to go long even to go short in this chart where it could not happen I prefer the target here about around 0 0.7850 area this week so but uh, be careful be aware take respond and trade only with money with, with you can lose ahead so uh, how do you say in English empty your cup of tea at once so you don't get disappear and even take this like you can lay, take the line wherever you want of course but also trade with a short entry or or on stop loss of course I created here a little bit above the old highs at 0 0.101 so be aware be prepared it's an uh, it's an intraday uh, shark animal and stick trade how do you say yes so uh, but uh, the New Zealand dollar grows in the last last week too much high in another cross pairs also against the Swiss franc much more so I would prefer to sell the New Zealand dollar and the Canadian dollar got a great day today 
in another cross pairs of not great but a good day so I, I would prefer or I would trade this wave the next 48 hours even perhaps for this week if, if uh, at last but not least if uh, the bulls are how do you say if the bulls wins this pattern here and go up take this line I would take this line as a short entry too if the price comes back this week short again and and uh, yes wait and see what will happen yes this area would be of course the target yo I hope you understand my uh, how do you say argues yes you can you could follow me of course you can follow me on Twitter and uh, yes wish you the best wherever whenever you're watching my video I hope I'm hoping it's useful for you and you can make some money too on the forex okay wherever whenever you are wish you best take care stay aware and take respond and I'm over and out peace Thank <laughs> you.